Hello and welcome to my kitchen. My name is Elaine and today we're going to make a cranberry tofu coconut dessert. It's gluten free, it's dairy free, no sugar added, it's ready in 5 minutes. It's delicious, it's nutritious and it's vegan. So this is a low calorie dessert because it's sweetened with cranberry and it's gluten free. And uh, tofu is a great substitute for cream cheese because it's texture, it's so silky. So stay with me, let's do this together. For this recipe, you're gonna need two cups of cranberries, one cup of coconut milk powder. I'm using this uh, product here, which is vegan and it has no milk ingredient. Some um, coconut milk powder has a milk ingredient which is called sodium cassanate. So always read the label to make sure it doesn't have any dairy uh, product. I'm using the tofu um, non-GMO and uh, this is a, a gluten-free recipe because there's no gluten in coconut or soy and this is one cup of coconut milk you're gonna need a powerful blender I'm using Vitamix or you can use a, a food processor we're gonna blend together the coconut milk and the cranberries once it's well blended like this we're gonna cut the tofu there's water inside, so make sure you remove the water. Squeeze. And then you're gonna add into this mixture. I'm using the firm tofu, but you can use medium or soft. Once it becomes smooth like this, we can add the coconut milk powder and blend again. And it's ready in less than five minutes. So it's a creamy texture and it's gonna get a little bit harder when you put it in the fridge or in the freezer. So I have some serving um, suggestion. If you wanna probably serve in a party, you can make like little cups like this and serve with a spoon. You can also uh, freeze or keep in the fridge with a container like this with the lid or glass container like this or in a bowl, smaller, bigger. So let's make a variety of uh, serving options so you have an idea. So you can eat as it is. It's already creamy and delicious or you can refrigerate. So I'm going to take to the fridge for about 2 hours or into the freezer for about 35 minutes. I hope you like this dessert idea and I hope to see you in my next video. Thanks for watching.